Hello. In this video, I want to talk a little bit about search engine meta tags inside of templates. And you can see here I'm in code view for one of my templates. And specifically, the code that I want to point out to you is this code right here. And you can kind of tell by reading it, it's basically telling search engines like Google and Bing not to index or archive your site. So these three tags are basically telling Google, Bing, and other search engines, go away. Don't list my site. Don't archive my site. Don't, don't list my site in your search engine at all. So before you're actually ready to publish your website, if you want it to be indexed by Google, Bing, other search engines, you're going to need to replace these tags or you're going to need to remove these tags in a minimum. Now you may be asking yourself why would anybody ever put these tags into a page? Doesn't everybody want their site listed in Google? And the answer is yes. Normally uh, most people are going to want their sites listed in Google but they're not going to want their sites listed in Google. They aren't going to want Google to come along and index their site before they're ready. So when you're actually in the process of building your site, when your site is in the construction phase, you're going to want to leave these tags in there so that Google doesn't index your site before you're ready or Bing or other search engines. So these are sort of tags that you leave in there while you're constructing your site. When the site's finished, you're going to delete them. If you've placed them inside of your template, once you delete them, you'll be able to save it and update all of your pages automatically. But you're going to want to check each page in your site to make sure that these no index tags um, have been removed when you're ready to actually um, publish your website. So these should only be left in there when you're actually building um, your site. Now, you shouldn't just delete these tags. You should actually delete them and replace them with the proper search engine tags for Google, Bing, and other uh, search engines. For example, you're going to want to include your Google site verification tag. You're going to want to include your Bing site verification tag, your Google Analytics code, um, and the proper um, search engine meta tags um, in your site that give search engines permission to index your site along with putting keywords and descriptions and setting up your titles and other things like that. So it's not only important to remove these three tags but you also need to replace them with the proper um, meta tags for your actual um, site. If you want to find out more about search engine meta tags, there's a couple different things you can do. One is you can go to Bing or Google's Webmaster Tools um, site, and they talk a lot about search engine optimization in uh, on their pages. Basically, everything you need to know is there. It's not organized very well, but all of it is on Google and Bing's um, website. Another thing you can do is you can download my um, search engine optimization guide, my SEO guide, and there's a link to that in the description for um, this video. So again, remember when you're ready to publish your site, remove these three tags and replace them with the proper um, search engine tags for your actual site. One other thing that I want to point your attention to is this fourth tag right here. It's uh, again a meta tag for robots. The content says no image index. And you're going to want to leave this tag in your site. Or you're going to want to make sure that each one of your pages again has this tag. And what this tag will prevent search engines from doing is gathering up the images from your website and including them in their image libraries. For example, if you go to images.google.com, you can see the millions and billions of images that Google has collected from people's websites. If you don't want your images to be sort of vacuumed up by search engines and included in their image libraries for other people to uh, see and grab, 
you're going to want to leave this tag in. So it's important to leave this tag in and remove these three tags and replace them with the proper search engine tags. And again, you can find out more about search engine optimization on Google or Bing Webmaster Tools site or by clicking the link in the description for this video and going to my SEO guide and you can find out uh, more information there.